Hello everyone YouTube, it's John, back again with another review. Today you can see below me I have this brown can, and it says Curious number t number 6. And if you've been a, a fan of my channel for a while, or a fan of this company, of these beverages for a while, you might have run across my reviews for the Curious numbers 1 through 5. They all have their own videos that I've done. Uh, what Curious Elixirs is, is a company that specializes in 0% alcohol craft cocktails. Um, each can or each variety is inspired by a real cocktail. And then they put their own uh, changes on it uh, to make it more special. This number 6 is their take on a painkiller or a pina colada cocktail. Uh, most of their cocktails are carbonated, however, this one is not. This is also the first one that comes in a can. Everyone prior to this one has come in some type of glass bottle. Uh, one came in like almost like a champagne style bottle, and the other ones came in more of like uh, stout bottles. Uh, this has um, 60 calories per serving. There's two servings in every can. Uh, there is some sugar in it. Uh, this is supposed to be a, a mix that infuses cream of coconut, pineapple, citrus, oat milk, chicory root, lemon balm, nutmeg, plus aloe, uh, and neroli. Um, and for that purpose, they do say if you're pregnant or lactating, uh, not to take this or at least consult a doctor, uh, because aloe and neroli haven't been studied enough, I guess, to be determined safe for uh, lactating women. <clears throat> but the ingredients are coconut cream, uh, pineapple juice, orange juice, lemon juice, lime juice, oat milk, aloe vera, concentrates, extracts of lemon balm, American oak, chicory, ginger, nutmeg, neroli, and black pepper, and blackstrap molasses essence. It's a lot. Um, yeah, there's other descriptions and stuff you can read on their website, which is CuriousElixirs.com. It's Elixir spelled E-L-I-X-I-R-S. CuriousElixirs.com. They have um, definitely one through four available. And... I know this one is a limited time. They have one, two, three, four, five, and six. It looks like everything is available right now. Though six is limited release. So, oh, and it says five is sold out. So they have one, two, three, four, and six currently. Anyway, let's open her up. Pour her into a glass. And it says to put a fresh grated nutmeg topping. So I have... This uh, chunk of nutmeg that I've been using for my nutmeg shavings, and I have my little rasper to grate it. It does already look like there might be some floaty bits of nutmeg already in there. You can see, like on the side of the bottle maybe my cup maybe I'm talking it through but I see like little chunks of what I think is nutmeg but fresh nutmeg on top is definitely going to give it a more of that nutmeg aroma let's get it oh, they say this is like a good holiday like eggnog type replacement. It does have coconut cream and oat milk in it. So it does have like some type of thickness. Definitely that fresh nutmeg scent is there. Let's give it a, a taste. That's really good. It's like this creamy coconut and the 
mix of juices you definitely get the flavors of like lemon lime pineapple and orange all in here I think the the aloe that's in here uh, kicks up like the viscosity of it which adds to that eggnog type consistency it's definitely not as thick as eggnog but this one's really tasty almost dangerously tasty um, like I said it's 60 calories per serving two servings per can so there's 120 calories in a can um, let's see what that means sugar wise Nutri nutrition 9 grams per serving, so 18 grams of sugar in the can. Um, but it comes from juices, uh, pineapple, orange, lemon, lime. I don't know if coconut cream has sugar in it. I don't know if aloe and oat milk have sugar in it. But uh, it's definitely sweet. It's delicious. Um, it's this combination of these sweet delicious fruit juices and these flavor extracts that add like this spice to it as well and it's mixed in with this coconut cream and this aloe aloe vera concentrate that thickens it up it really makes it like coat your mouth and you get this flavor just all around and it stays there and it's an enjoyable flavor that stays there no bad aftertaste. The minute it hits your tongue, pure enjoyment. Um, I'm going to say, of all the curious ones I've tried so far, this curious number six is definitely the most delicious beverage of them. Um, with the caveat that you, this, this is almost too good that you might want to drink too much and then it'll have too much sugar. But uh, if you can limit yourself... To one beverage I would say this is pretty good uh, especially if you're comparing it to instead of this having a glass of eggnog this is probably better for you I think eggnog is a lot more sugarier and everything else but delicious I would recommend um, comes in a four pack this is the first one I've opened. Looking forward to the others. I'm looking forward to finishing this one. Uh, recommend. Two thumbs up. Curious number six. If you're looking for a holiday beverage that's non-alcoholic to replace an eggnog or just to have on hand at a holiday party or you don't you want to have something special that's not water or diet soda Try this. Curious number six. Highly recommended by me, the fat hipster. And you know that's the seal of approval every company is looking for these days. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more. Uh, look up my other curious one through five uh, videos. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Curious number seven. Whenever that happens, be lucky number seven. Maybe they'll do it for like St. Patrick's Day. Is there any St. Patrick's Day style cocktails? I'm sure there is. They'll make a green one. Be lucky. Lucky curious number seven. We'll see you on that video. Whenever that will be. Bye.